Guys, I haven't made a video on multicasting yet. And I guess the reason behind that is because my experience so far with the multicast system has been relatively negative. I think for the reasons that the majority of the community don't like multicasting, uh, some of the imbalances with it, but also like the quality of life of having to grind long hours to get learning tokens or master a character and then you roll your learning tokens and you don't get what you want. So then you have to wait days to then reset with mind wipe. It's been a bit of a tedious process so far. However, thankfully the devs did give us a massive quality of life change today, meaning that you can unlock all 13 learning tokens by level 70 now, instead of having to grind to 270. A massive reduction in the time spent to try and unlock a full multi-class build. Also, you can mind wipe daily now, so I can experiment daily with new builds if I want to. And the one I'm running currently isn't necessarily anything super inventive. In fact, you've probably seen something like it before. It uses Warlock as a base with Wizard's Staff Mastery perk, giving my magic staff three magic weapon damage, a bit like a crystal sword. I then run Dark Reflection from Warlock so that if my opponent attacks me with a melee attack they then get damaged themselves uh, i then have ice shield from the wizard meaning that if they attack me with a melee attack they will have a 20 percent move speed and action speed penalty against them uh, this is super important because it actually allows me to get a second hit in with the magic staff which is a very slow attacking weapon so if without that i probably wouldn't get second attacks in before they get their second attack in. Uh, it also also gives me the, the 20 armor rating, which is important for PDR as well. And then I have Faithfulness, which boosts my divine magic damage by 15%. And it's actually been buffed this patch as well, adding a move speed penalty of 15% for 1.5 seconds whenever there is a divine attack. What divine magic am I using? I'm using Judgment from Cleric. 25 divine magical damage and also reduces the move speed bonus of my opponent by 30% for two seconds. And then I have Blow of Corruption to finalize the build. And it basically plays out like this. I open with a Judgment. I then activate Blow of Corruption. I swing my Blow of Corruption into their head and then they retaliate by attacking me, which kills them. That's the whole combo if it works out. Although certain enemies in the dungeon aren't necessarily killable. Iron Will, Demon Armor, Robust, hundreds of health, full PDR and magic resistance. How do you kill those guys? I guess that's what this video is about. Look at this guy with his golden boots, his golden cloak, and his grim smiles. He's proper bissed out. He has Iron Will, so he has a lot of magic resistance. His MDR is 45%. I'm assuming that's after Iron Will has been applied. We're definitely not too showing this guy. What 146 health. We can assume he's going to take 50% less damage from other magic damage. Have to play that one a bit slower. Really, I should be able to like hit him with Judgment, hit him with a BOC, back up, you know, pop a potion, that kind of stuff. Like I can use my shield and uh, Superman, uh, Iron, uh, Captain America him. Should I try killing the Cyclops? I haven't done it yet with this build. Oh man, I can't hit his head. Do I think Ice Shield is very good? I do. Yeah, it's uh, a lot of movement speed, a lot of action speed reduced. It can it can get you away from a fight, disengage a fight.
<laughs> Dude, I just fuck him, don't I? Oh, never mind. My car speed needs to be higher. I just need to keep cutting him. Maybe I just leave, actually. I don't think it's worth risking anything for him. I don't know, what do you guys think? One shit shot, headshot. No, he doesn't have that loaded. He wants to shut the door here. I've just given him the shot for free. Does hurt. Damn, I might die here. I think we just both reset. Really? That angle was there? I think I can win this fight. Damn, I hate when I miss that. He's really good at baiting.
bit of a stalemate. New player. He can have the portal, I guess. Oh, that's going to hurt. I'm just going to go static. It's possible the static's already been taken, which would mean I would have to go back to where he is. There's two portals there. Looks like static's been taken. Yep, okay. I'm going to have to play for portal. Push through him. Annoying. That's a big hit. He's panicking. Let's go! Holy shit! That was a fucking great fight, dude. That was like the best solos fight I've ever had. We both understood the assignment. We both played it as best as we could. He could have won that with one hit. I won it with the one hit. It went down to the wire. G fucking G! <laughs> Let's go! Holy moly. <laughs> Oh man, that was on the edge of my seat the whole time. Bro, I tried to take everything that I seemed valuable considering I had like no health, not much time. I don't know if I got the valuable stuff. All right, how much for my shit back? Bro, you just name the price, I'll give it to you. That was a great fight. Everyone enjoyed that. GG's bro, that was an intense round. Like I said, low on cash, all good. I don't mind. I don't need to make huge amounts of money. I got the troll pelt. Cinema truly Dowsy? Yeah, that was that was something else, dude. That was something else. That, that entire game. One could say it was an intestine fight. Alright. That's uh that was bad enough that I have to end the stream.